Well, the SDGs for us have been a very reassuring framework. We are working on gender equality since Beijing and even before our commitments are very much about promoting the economic empowerment of women, about promoting leadership, women in, in social and political sphere, national and local levels, parliaments and local governments. We also are very committed to push for women being listened in climate change negotiations, adaptation plans, and uh, also other area of work that for us is very prominent and we are very committed to is uh, to address and eradicate violence against women, including sexual violence. We also work in crisis countries, therefore all this package of economic empowerment linked to better boys and uh, women in decision making. We try to put together all of these components, uh, like the SDGs, and interconnect all of them to make things happen. Well, I think the most significant action is a mindset, is a behavioral change, and is to consider goal five as their business. Gender equality is the business of the private sector. Once they realized and take ownership about SDG 5, about gender equality and the economic empower and the empowerment of women, they start doing other changes, therefore. It's difficult to say only one thing, to select what is the most urgent or what is the most important message to send to companies. And I think that if they really take ownership o over gender equality, the rest of the actions will come naturally. How, how the world will be better if you can just imagine that women can walk and feel safe on the streets, or when they came back home, they also feel that uh, they don't feel fear, they are safe, safe also at home, or they can select the education or the profession that they want, and they can even rule a country. It's very, very basic, but if we can imagine that, and we can imagine that not even one woman is going to be raped anymore, that's the world that we want, right?